Hey everybody. So uh, <clears throat> I've gotten really serious again about getting back in shape and uh, it feels really good. It's been <clears throat> about three and a half weeks since I started and um, I made some other changes too that uh, have affected my life in really positive ways and uh, it feels fantastic. So I uh, just want to talk a little bit about my process. So I got a uh, Fitbit, which looks like this. And um, what it does is tells you how many steps you took in a day, mileage, and uh, so on. It tells you how active you are. And today uh, I took 5,000 steps so far, which is about half of my daily steps. Uh, 1.82 miles, which is kind of low. I burned 2,196 calories and went seven flights of stairs, uh, which is surprising because I don't remember doing that. And uh, it has a little activity count, uh, counter. It also uh, tells you how well you're sleeping. And surprisingly, generally, I sleep at 100% sleep efficiency or, or like 95% to 100%, which is really cool. The other thing that I do, which is related to the Fitbit, is I use MyFitnessPal, um, which I think is owned by About.com. Um, but essentially, the way that I lost before, the way that I lost 100 calories, or 100 calories, 100 pounds plus before was just by counting calories, by measuring my food and making sure that I, I tracked it. And now, with online services like uh, MyFitnessPal, it's really easy to do that, surprisingly easy to do. So um, what is uh, really cool is that you eat some food. Like this morning I went to Wawa and got a coffee, and I always put the same amount of um, fat-free milk and Splenda in it. And so I just save that as a, a food that I have, and I add it in like one click. And it tells me that... Um, you know, it's 57 calories for this huge coffee. And uh, it also tells me how many calories I've left in the day. It takes into account the fact that I'm a male and that I'm uh, 38 and that I'm six foot two and, and so on. And it tells me in order to lose a couple pounds every week, how much and calories I can eat. So between the Fitbit, which updates automatically whenever I walk in the room, wherever the transmitter is, it's the little USB-based transmitter, um, and me counting calories, I get a steady total all day long of how much I can eat, how active I am, uh, how much I'm losing, it tracks all that stuff. And so uh, it's a really effective really straightforward way to manage your nutrition and your and your weight and your exercise. So um, for anybody who wants to lose, I highly suggest this uh, pairing. Uh, the Fitbit is a hundred bucks. My fitness pal is free. And um, the commitment that you have to make is that you're going to try to stay under this number. You sort of need to think about it almost like a budget, like a like a monetary budget. So if you're good with money, chances are I would suggest that you're going to be good with your calorie count. That if you pay attention to a number and you stay below that number in other ways, uh, and you you know think in the reverse, you you think about how much income you need to make. You know, the same is true for calories. Calories burned, calories eaten and you need to keep that in balance and and that's really it so i uh, hope this helps anybody who is looking to um get involved in losing weight because i don't feel healthy i mean i feel really healthy comparative to three weeks ago uh, but i still don't feel like me i feel like um i'm me and then some which is not a good thing. So, um, I'm going to do it. Uh, nice to talk to y'all. I'll talk to you again soon.